what's going on guys let's ready to learn some more interesting things we're gonna make the table so for creating the table we have to create the main tag for the table first the table tag okay now all the data which you just want to put inside the table you have to go inside and put the data I'm just going inside the table and uh, let's just put the data first and then we have to divide the tables into two ways the table head and the table body okay I'm not talking about the main HTML main HTML head in the body tag but inside the table the T head it means this is clearing that the table head and the T body oh sorry about that the T body that's pretty perfect now I just need to go to the T head to put the data which I just want to show as the head of the table okay now this is a very basic of the table the game is starting for every single raw we have to create a raw and then inside the raw we have to create multiple cells okay so basically we're not going column wise we are going raw wise in the table so for the T head I'm just putting the TR what the mean of TR the table raw okay the TR means the table raw now we have to put the cells inside the table raw and here I'm just gonna put the cells TD is equal to a cell but I'm not putting the TD here because I'm just putting TH the mean of TH is table head cell T head okay well when in the body we will put the table data the TD but there we are just putting the table head so now for the first one column I'm just putting uh, s dot n o and duplicating now this is another cell and what I'm just putting here remove the s n o and I'm just typing the name duplicate father name just simple data whatever you want to put um, after the father name I'm just putting about the you know contact number okay I can put anything whatever I want or you want basically so now I'm just going to the T head inside sorry in the T body and again inside the T body we have to create the raws so the TR the first one raw and going inside I don't think that it's looking a little bit typical to you it's really easy to understand just try this well now we have to put the first column inside the T body now don't forget that we are in the T body but still we have to follow the the structure we put it in the T head okay so the first column in the T head was the SNO so exactly in the T body we have to put the data appropriatable with this one the SNO so the TD okay now what I'm just putting in the in the first TD the first TD is should be number one and then we are about to go to the next column so in the next column what's what is in the head the in the head this is the name so exactly in the next column the second column we have to put the name I'm putting my own name Shazeb Kamal and then duplicate the father name the father name is Kamal Ahmad duplicate and then the contact number exactly I'm not gonna give my contact number here so the blah 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 whatever save and go back to the browser and refresh now this is a simple table so basically I, I hope you have understood that how to collect data in the tables in the HTML so this is a simple uh, the th tag and this is the td tag and well something more we can do what we can do if I just go to the tables main tag I can put the border I can create the border by using the border attribute and exactly you know the way now what the way do you want for the border I just want the one point border refresh now this is the butter we got that well what more I can do I can just uh, go down this is the second row you know and, and I'm just creating the third row basically this is the first row of the T body and the second row this one this one is the first row of the T body and the second row of the table so in the table T body this is the second row and again I'm just doing the same thing the TD and for the first what was the first heading the first heading was SNO so the value should be you can put any value but here you have you know that we have to add the increment so the two and duplicate and there the second name I'm just putting the John Smith I can put anything you know the father name I'm just putting the Smith uh, mark whatever 
now the, as a contact number blah 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 now save and go back to the browser and refresh now you can see that one and now this is the this is the two and then this is the data for the one number this is data for the two number and in the same way you can put the data as much as you want and basically you've created the table number three and there I'm just updating the data I'm just typing the Sean hike so there I'm just typing hike and the contact number I'm just updating this whatever and save and go back to the browser and refresh okay so in this way we can create the table exactly you I, I hope you want to adjust uh, the table and you want to put uh, you want to design something in the table so go back to the notepad if I just go to the starting tag and uh, after the border the border attribute I just put the width okay the, I'm just putting the value for the width and what the value I'm just putting here is uh, like about 500 and save and go back to the browser and refresh now the width is actually changed. The, the, the old width, width was a default width and was adjusted automatically but now I can put the 500, I can put the 800, whatever I want. So refresh that back. Now this is 800. If I just restore to default, this is the default view and looking not bad. Go back to the notepad and uh, I'm just making this again as the previous one. So go back to the notepad again uh, and put another space. Now I can put the height too. If I just put the height uh, as 500 to so save and go back to the browser and refresh now, you can see that every block increased and uh, got a beautiful height because of the, I just put it the 500, if I just put the 300, so refresh now, it's looking a little bit uh, more simple, but I'm just removing the height because I just want to show you some more interesting. There are a lot of tables, oh sorry, a lot of attributes in the table, I'll, I'm thinking to teach you in the next class because you can confuse. but don't be don't be confused this is really really easy to understand just practice this whatever i teach you then we will go to the next class guys stay tuned and goodbye